Okay, welcome to Politics NY with Sky. Schneps Media is asking each candidate running for New York City office this year three questions in three minutes. And right now, I'm with current district leader, William Allen. He's running for Council District 9, that's in Harlem, Northern Manhattan. And we're here for three minutes with him to get to know him a little bit. And I see, William, you have a cool shirt on that says Legends something. Legends are born in Harlem. There you go. <laughs> Tell us about yourself, sir. Well, this actually, this shirt comes from my, one of my mentees. He brought it back from, uh, from Africa um, a couple of weeks, about a couple of months ago. Uh, he's a national youth leader at the National Action Network, which I recruited him. He's also a member of a junior 100 black men. And we met, we met with Chuck Schumer. Uh, 100 black men threw a dinner. Uh, he was trying to get a picture with Chuck Schumer. Everybody kept jumping in front of him. I said, come on, kid, I'll set up the picture. And from that moment, I became his mentor. Oh, that's a nice story. So he brought me this beautiful shirt back from, from Africa. This was actually uh, made in Africa. Awesome. And don't you miss those parties where we were all jumping on top of each other to get a picture with whoever's in the room? Yes, I miss that. I miss it so much. But, but he'll be back. Good times yeah. will be back. And I see what you were out petitioning today. I saw some petitions. Yes, I was out petitioning. Actually, I'm running around to collect petitions. We have a, a, an incredible team of about maybe 75 people uh, who's out there helping to get petitions, lodging people who are members of the Uptown Democratic Club, uh, civic leaders, and, and this longtime supporters of, of my work here. And I want to say in this, this in Harlem, but around the country. So there are a lot of people running for council district nine this year. And, and yes. what, what about you makes you the best candidate for that seat? Well, I would say, I, I would say that my qualifications uh, make me a unique candidate for this particular time now. That the community needs someone uh, who can hit the ground running, uh, identify the financial resources and other resources to address the many issues that this community faced with, not only uh, that, that they faced, not only during the COVID pandemic, but even prior to that, the issues about affordable housing, affordable commercial space. I mean, now you're going to some restaurants in Harlem and the meal is just it's more expensive than the ones downtown. So we want Harlem to be affordable all around. And so we want uh, business owners to feel that it's a safe investment. We want folks to continue to want to live here and say that it's affordable for them and to raise a family or just to live even as an individual. But we want Harlem to stay the unique, iconic community that it is. And, the, and especially because of the, histor the historical significance of Harlem. So William, I know that your past position was with the National Action Network founded by Reverend Al Sharpton. So what was it like working on that initiative. It was really incredible. It took everything I've had in my lifetime in my career into one opportunity to not only serve Harlem and New York, but the entire country. As a national crisis director, I got to help feed uh, 2.5 million people. Uh, thousands of folks who were in need of crisis assistance were able to reach out to me in the organization, get assistance. I develop a, a, a system by which people can be helped all across the country. Um, most of them were brown and black. And I created a national crisis network of volunteers and lawyers and advocates around crisis management. What was unique about it is that I got to know the Eric Gardner family, uh, the Jacob Blake family, and other families that experienced police violence or other kind of violence in their family and their community and got to understand what was happening and I was able through that to come up with some solid recommendations of how we can address police and community relations. And that was during COVID last year. That was during, during COVID. During all That's of right. 2020. Yeah, that was during COVID where I had to even come up with uh, ways by which to reach people since I no longer could have meetings. And, and quite frankly, COVID helped to improve how we reached out to people through technology. That's William Allen. Thank you, sir, for spending time with us, candidate for District 9. And this is Schneps Media's Three Questions in Three Minutes. And I'm Sky with Politics NY.